Mr. Speaker, yesterday, Communist China, as part of its systematic campaign to dismantle democracy in Hong Kong, arrested eight pro-democracy politicians. Meanwhile, Communist China continues to escalate threats against democratic Taiwan by sending sorties into Taiwanese airspace on 25 of the past 31 days of October. Enough is enough. When will this government impose sanctions on Chinese communist officials? The Honorable Minister of Foreign Affairs. Mr. Speaker, I'd like to thank uh, my honorable member for uh, his important question. Mr. Speaker, we have been standing up at every step of the way, Mr. Speaker. If you look at the case of Hong Kong, Mr. Speaker, Canada was the very first country in the world to suspend the extradition treaty between Canada and Hong Kong. We then suspended the export of equipment and we adopted our travel advisory. Mr. Speaker, at every step of the way, we have been standing up for values and principle with our allies around the world. We will continue to stand up for the values and principle. And Mr. Speaker, we will always continue to fight for democracy around the world.